Hello and welcome to Ben's Addiction. Today we have a new issue. The check engine light for this CLK 500 A209 is on. The engine is M113 and the error code or uh, default code is P0199. So P20DC002. So let's diagnose this together and see if we the change of potentiometer or the TPS or the throttle position sensor will fix this issue. So as you can see here is the problem. The check engine light is on and if I press on gas pedal nothing happens so the car only idles so let's fix this together okay what we need to take off the gas or accelerator pedal is this uh, cap over here it's a plastic cap that uh, you need to remove in order to access this number 10 mil uh, hex bolt so I'm already undoing this and there should be only one bolt so it's so easy okay so here's the situation you need to also slide down the gas pedal in order to be able to take it because obviously there is some sorts of clip up there so it's almost out now i just need to undo the connector for the uh, tps or throttle position sensor so we can take it off and that was easy so what actually holds the gas pedal in place is uh, this little plastic over here and that 10 millimeter uh, bolt that you would remove from here. So make sure you uh, put this one first, which is at very top section. It goes into a, a bracket, a hole, and then you can, uh, using that stud there, Put back the 10 millimeter nut but if you need the part number it's a203 300 so pretty much this is a wo3 gas pedal and uh, i think there should be all the same but you need to check that for yourself so looking at my connector i can't see any anything wrong here just the corrosion or anything like that it seems to be in a good shape so I don't think there is any issue over here with the corrosion of the connector and looking inside this connector over here it actually doesn't seem so bad so here I've got both of the accelerator pedals together this is for my uh, 320 which is a six cylinder this is for my A uh, 209 which is eight cylinder and they both have the same uh, part number I think Mercedes doesn't want anyone to only replace uh, the sensor because these and um, uh, These screws over here. These are uh, security type of uh, screws as you can see there is a one boldness inside if my camera Get some focus so it's actually better to replace the whole gas pedal and I think it is even possible to use the uh, CLK 55 or C 55 which has the sport kind of gas pedal if you want to do that but uh, let's go ahead and uh, put my CLK 320 gas pedal uh, inside the CLK 500 and see if that works and that actually uh, takes away the fault code 
and the problem. Okay, I partially installed back the gas pedal from my 320 in uh, my CLK 500. Okay, let's check to see if the light will disappear by itself or do I need to reset the codes and clear the codes. Okay, the check engine light is there. I just want to see Okay, the first time I was able to rev up this engine. So it actually works. Uh, the reason why I have a, a check engine light over there is my left hand side oxygen sensor as well. So I'm pretty sure this is going to work. Okay, here's the situation. So I just scanned the car with the uh, CLK320 gas pedal which is the new one and it it has the uh, fault code stored as you can see and if I press F3 here codes cleared okay and then if I try to start up the car again Yes, as you can see, the check engine light is gone. And if I press on that pedal, so you need to clear the fault codes after you replace your accelerator pedal to get rid of that check engine light. And touch on the wood. Uh, that accelerator pedal uh, fault code is not back yet because uh, my check engine light is off and here again I diagnosed uh, the car while it's running after the replacement of the sensor and it passes the uh, all the code so there is no more code in there and everything is good so guys, P0122, it's most probably the uh, TPS, which is throttle position sensor or accelerator sensor. So guys, thank you so much for watching. Please watch my other videos on CLK and R129, A209, W209, C209. Have a good day.